Hi friends. This case is about business. Pure the quest for cellulosic biofuels. In 2012, Pure was in the process of starting biofuels production at its first plant in Columbus, Mississippi. This initial plant was to provide a commercial scale proof of concept of Kior's production technology, and the company expected to build another set of plants in Natchez, MS using copy exact principles. These latter plants would be three times the size of the Columbus plants, and Kior anticipated a number of improvements in its production methodology. Among these were one an increase in its conversion yield, or the volume of biofuel, that it could produce from an inputted ton of biomass feedstock, and to a decrease in input costs. Pure Biofuels and Renewable Identification Number RIN credits associated with the Renewable Fuel Standard 2 RFS2 administered by the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency EPA. Since RINs had a market value, the RFS2 provided a subsidy to Kior. However, it was unclear whether the credits would retain a value beyond 2022, and Kior was in a race to realize the potential improvements in production technology and costs before RI and support vanished. This case examines the break-even cost of the Kior production technology, with and without cost improvements, and with and without RI and support. It provides representative assumptions that students can use to analyze Kior's business model and its sensitivity to policy support. The case package includes an Excel workbook that can be given to students to explore sensitivity analyzes around technological and RI and value uncertainties. Thanks for watching this video.